Hey, Knife Nerds. Uh, you know, I was thinking since we're selling these uh, pull the dot soft loops now, um, if you've not used one of those before, you might be a little confused if you order one of those as an add on item for your one of our knives. So I thought I'd make a video and show how uh, you can attach that to your uh, knife sheath for a uh, scout carry on your belt. So the pull the dot comes with this uh, small screw and basically it's just the other part of the snap that goes on the end of the other end of the strap there. And then these are two items that we include that so that you can attach them to your knife. Uh, it comes with the Chicago barrel female screw there and a rubber spacer washer standoff. So um, the pull the dot strap comes with, there's the three holes so, so that you can adjust that for the width of your belt. Um, I think they're one uh, inch and a quarter, inch and a half, and inch and three quarters. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, remove the sheath from the Kiridashi here. And the first thing I'm gonna do is take the barrel screw and I'm gonna punch that through the back of the bottom hole here. So you can imagine if this is the way that it's gonna to attach to your belt, that barrel screw goes through the back like that. And then we're gonna use the, this bottom hole here as our attachment where we're gonna attach it. And so what we're gonna do is take this small screw and put it through the top of this snap like that. Okay. And then we're gonna take the standoff and we're gonna put the screw through that. And you're just gonna have a little bit of threads coming through on the bottom there. And so then I'm I'm putting the rubber standoff on the front of the sheath. You could you might prefer to put it on the back, but I'm doing that because I don't want to scratch up this rivet with this metal snap here. So, just gonna. So I've got the oops, I've got the snap, the rubber washer, and the screw, and those are gonna sit on top of that hole, and then this barrel screw is gonna come through the bottom like that, and I'm just gonna use a flat screwdriver to to drive that uh, barrel screw. It's faster if you use your fingers to kind of get it on there kind of snug and then just finish it up with the driver. So once you have that on there as tight as you want it. Obviously you can uh, you can tighten it this way as well with the Phillips driver. So once you have that as tight as you want it um, you're going to attach this snap. So these snaps are really really stiff when you first get them. It takes a little bit of snapping and unsnapping to break them in. But the trick to putting it on the first time is to put it on this way, not this way. It's nearly impossible to snap it down this way. So you're just going to take that little uh, spring on the bottom there and make sure that that's on the snap first and then that'll allow you to snap it down. And that's Ready to go. Just put your Kiridashi in there. And uh, like I said, you can put that spacer on the back if you like. I'm just, uh, for this demo, I'm just putting it on the front so I don't scratch that rivet with the snap. Thanks guys.